Hello, adventurers! I'm Grey, and welcome back to Deep Space Turtle Chase. Now, I am in this room trying to solve a puzzle to turn back on the power to all these alien facilities on this alien planet I'm on, so I can continue the story. And there's a little hint over here, which I'm going to take a quick gander at. Pressing this button sends a pulse of water down the glass tubing on either side of you. Try to use the levers to guide the water into the proper output. Okay, got it. So I'm going to start this up and see what it looks like. So where does the water go? Kind of flows down that side, flows down that way, and then it stops. And then there it keeps going down. So what's the proper output? In there, I guess, right? And on this side, it's right there. So I have to adjust these levers. But what do these levers do? They go down to there. I don't actually see it changing anything. Oh! What did that open? Oh, it opened that. Okay, so that's something that I should be doing then. That one's already closed, right? Yeah. Where am I trying to get the water to exactly? I'm pretty sure it's right there. Oh, I think those are alerting the security turret. So that would be a bad idea. That blocks that way off, which is good. I don't want to alert the turret. Actually, is this side done? Let me, let me test this. Water flows down that way this way and both oh then it flows towards the nearest hole it flows down there towards the nearest hole and that one's taken care of okay and now i can just focus on this side it's not a very difficult puzzle to be fair it doesn't seem that hard where does the water start at we can... starts up top there okay i forget the flow to that side so can i block that off no how about with this one? Oh yeah 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 and now it flows this way. I need to block off that one too. Not that. There we go. And now it should flow down to the correct spot. Let's watch it. In F5 mode. Oh, there it goes. You do the loop, de loop, and pull. And the door is looking unlocked. Is that it? Have I done it? Have I cracked the code? So if I go up now, is there supposed to be like some some big notification that I've done it or something? I'm not sure. I'm gonna go up now and take a look to see if it's been done. What do you know? The door is unlocked. Power is back on. I've overridden the system. I have no turrets going after me anymore. And I can place the power in. There we have it. Everything is back online. We're finally operational. No idea why there is so much atmospheric charge in the area, but we're set up to harness it now. The military brass require nuclear fissile unit compatibility in case of emergency. But with all this energy in the air, I don't see how we'll ever need it. Operational logs, power readings, and all kinds of boring stuff. Your browser to one of the first entries. APA 137. That's a lot of energy. And I won't pretend I know what all these symbols mean. But we're, we have nuclear fissile energy, so I know that'll provide a lot of power. That means I should be able to access the big facility now, actually. Oh, 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 I have a hint. Now that you've managed to reroute the power, you'll probably find some newly accessible locations. And an incoming transmission, is it from... It's from Schmidt. Okay, let's get to a good area to read it. Huh, you did it. I can see a low power rating originating from the dig site. Head over- wait, scratch that. Uh, a high power rating. A really high power rating and maybe a few weapons powering up. Ah, I'm sure you'll be fine. Okay, I think I need to stop reading and just get going before all these weapons power up and I get in trouble. Just, just run, just run across the field. None of the weapons will spot me. It's all okay. It's all good. Go into the dig site. Don't worry about it. Actually, is there a pressure plate in front of these? If I can access it? No, I can't. Okay, that's the dig site over there. Has a nice green flag. You know, whoever designed that flag really needs some more creativity. Who's supposed to remember and be inspired by your, your country or your facility having a completely green flag? Come on. We made it. Boys, we did it. We're in. We're, we're in. What does this say? Oh, it's Dr. Testudine. Oh, not you again. Why, thank you, Professor. 
Turning on the power station saved me the trouble of hunting you down. <laughs> now your position is lit up like a light bulb. No, <laughs> lit up like a, a lightning bug. And like a bug I will crush you. You know, I really like your picto chat illustration of what you're going to do to Professor Schmidt. But you know what? I won't let you do this. Oh, what else do you have to say? Enjoy what little time you have left, antagonist. I am coming to handle you personally. But don't hold your breath. I won't make the same mistake twice. This time I think I will simply multinize that entire region. Let's see you escape from that. Jesus Christ, these drawings are absolutely beautiful. And when I said Professor Smith earlier, I'm pretty sure he just meant me, Professor Tagonist. Though, he hates Smith too, but... You know what? No, he's Captain Schmidt, so I'm the professor. I keep getting mixed up. Okay, don't worry about any mess-ups I make in the names. I am Professor Tagonist, and that is Captain John Schmidt, also known as Captain Sparkles, also known as Jardon. So, that's alright. Storage. You know what? This storage doesn't seem to be storing that much. I can't even access these units! Probably because they're half slabs. I should know. I have 58 of them. <laughs> that I definitely didn't cheat to break because I was confused by that door puzzle earlier and didn't want to get crushed every time. Here's a big facility, and we're getting a lot of story going on here. What's this? Oh, great, you're through. Huh. Mm, this is odd. Something is keeping my active sensors from seeing inside. Mind if I hitch a ride in your optics? This will only take a moment. And... Done. Whoa. Nice place. There's no way this was some simple mining operation. There must be something we can use in here somewhere. Have a look around and see what you can find. Okay, so now Captain Schmidt has hacked into my mainframe. He's in my visor and he can see all around me. All of the equipment, all of the text. Evacuation protocol, epsilon, all personnel proceed to lower fractality construct immediately. I don't know why I gave the computer a lisp. <laughs> uh, can I sleep? I want to sleep through the rainstorm. The rain's a little bit loud. Ooh, what's down here? Is this where all the personnel hide at? Ooh, there's a big pipe down there. I guess that's sewage. Oh, and here's the planet. Does not look like Earth. In fact, this looks like a thermal reading of the planet. So maybe it's hotter at some sections. Let's proceed down the hallway. This is a large building I'm in, though. This mining facility. So I'm not sure where's the correct way to go, per se. We'll figure it out though. All data systems online, records and saved info. New new Grumpton archives. Yay! Yeah, these aren't gonna do anything. They're not like attached to any redstone or anything like that. Quirkus schematics, Pangea data file storage. This was before they added item frames, so I guess these are symbolic of like drawers on these cabinets, like a library. And you're supposed to be able to grab these like handles and pull it open and get any files from it. Nowadays you have like, put like an anvil and an item frame or something like that, or a carpet or something. Or I think I see a lot of people use a steel or an iron pressure plate. And if you put in an item frame, it goes horizontal and it looks like a handle to something. There's, there's more advanced decorations now. Let's see. Here's some of the bedrooms it looks like. Oh no, the... <laughs> Here are some of the bedrooms, guys. I found it. This is this is where I sleep, right in there. And this is where I read my books. Uh, you know, it's, it's not entirely wrong. Except nowadays, it's more like this is where I read my phone. If you sprinkle when you tinkle, be a sweetie. Wipe the seedy. Or else! <laughs> okay, well, that's a motto I'm going to not remember from here on out. Ooh, ooh, more meds. I already have plenty. I could probably eat one right now, actually. Uh, we're lacking the eating sound effect, of course, because who uses that? Epsilon. What does it say? Aptilophaki. Here, let's create an acronym for this, guys. All personnel proceed to leave facility. Uh, con con facility containment immediately. <laughs> I think that was a pretty suitable acronym for on the spot, just improvising it right then and there. Let's check out this section, though. Because I'm pretty sure I'm going to need to go 
that way. Because it's straight ahead. It just makes sense. Or I go up. I'm so uncertain as to where's the correct way to go, but I'm just wandering around. It's like an open world game. I love it. I'm gonna check up the stairs now. This is a nice little balcony though. I guess this is where you overlook the mining facilities, which I probably get a pretty good view of it by destroying some of this stuff. Yeah, there we go. Look at this mining place. Looks nice. It's almost like this is Minecraft. But no, this is Deep Space Total Chase. Completely different. It's like a whole it's like a whole new game. Oh, I can't sprint up the stairs. That's interesting. It stops my sprint when I go upstairs. Classic beta Minecraft. Except, <laughs> I say that and then I realize that Classic and Beta Minecraft are both different versions of Minecraft. And it's just really confusing. Okay, so let's go to way I thought we would need to go. Straight forward. That's, that's the only way I look. Straight ahead. I'm always focusing on the future, you know. That's just the way I am. Oh, I got turned around, actually. That completely contradicts what I just said. Apparently not. Oh, what's this, a spruce sapling? Spruce sapling, I guess. Well, I'm gonna wander around until I find the correct way then. <laughs> I never really explored down here, actually, so I'm sure there must be some more areas to take a look at down here. Oh, oh! Incoming transmission, okay. What do you got to say to me, Captain Schmidt? The place sure was deserted in a hurry. Seems like this panel unlocks the next chamber and the room's upstairs. One, two, three, five. That's strange. The numbers count to five, but there are four lights. I guess there's five buttons if you count the answer key. But there are four lights. Anyways, maybe someone left the combo lying around somewhere. Okay, so I need to find the combination code. Hopefully it's somewhere around here. This is sort of a another monitoring area, I guess. Oh, it's, what is this? Another defense station, last audio log. Yes, Harry, you are a dead man. That's a reference. I'm pretty sure that's a reference. Okay, what about this one, this defense area? This looks like a defense station. Last audio log. Hagrid! I can't track all of them! There's no way we- The Beardo bot is down! Get a zip rep to the Overseer! They're gonna breach! It appears they got breached. And the defense station fell apart and Harry was a dead man. Maybe that's not a reference. Maybe Harry is just a dead man. That's just Harry's fate. There's no stopping fate. The wheels of fate keep turning. Master unlock code is probably somewhere around here. Must be like hidden, right? Not back here, it seems. I'll use, I'll keep my magic wand in hand in the hunt. What do these buttons do? One of these buttons has to do something, right? Some of these computers are turned on. Hmm. Maybe none. Oh, that button did something. What did it open? Oh, it opened this, okay. This is going to be some long text. Wish me luck in reading all this. Counting down. The center holds. The falcon hears the falconer. Assume the relaxation length of photons in the sample atmosphere is constant. One degree angle nominal. Seascape portrait of the woman child cavern of the soul. Under pressure. Heat ratio. Ides. Ideas of evolutions have buried their fears. End of line. Accepting scan. Love outlasts death. Spins and turns, angles and curves. The shape of dreams, half remembered. Limiting diffusions to two dimensions increases the number of evolutionary jumps within the species. Transformation is the goal. They will not harm their own. The makers of the makers fall before the child. Accessing defense system. Handshake. Handshake. Second level clear. Hey! A master unlock code! Lucky you. 1251. End of line. Begin reintegration of right hemisphere subcommand routines. Patterns. The universe C. Begin reintegration of command subroutines. Back in the stream that feeds the ocean that feeds the stream. Mists of dreams drip along the nascent echo and love no more. End of line. I feel like I just had an aneurysm. Anyway, I got the unlock code. We have 1251. Let's see what else is around here, but. We should probably go ahead and put that in, actually. See what it unlocks. There is one doorway I haven't accessed, but I'm guessing that 1251 will open that doorway down there, potentially. 1, 2, 5, 1. 
Oh, what did that do? Oh, it did open the doorway. What do you know? I was right. <laughs> so I've been finding the correct way all along. Oh, what's this? What is this? Is this sand? It's sponge. It sounds like grass when I walk on it. I guess that's the old sponge walking sound. You may be able to use the drainage system to your advantage to make this path fit for travel. Make sure you've explored the overseer's office in order to gain access. Okay, fine. I'm gonna store all that stuff. Heck, I don't even need that anymore. So I need to send in some water to turn that to obsidian and cobblestone. Preferably. I've already went to the overseer's office. So there must be another way to go. Oh. I feel like this is supposed to open. Or maybe it's just broken. Maybe that's just how it is. Hmm. There's water in there, and there must be some way to breathe the water. But how though? Let me let me let me get the hint again. What does it say? That's not it. The first one. You may be able to use the drainage system to your advantage to make this path fit for travel. Where's the overseer's office? Was that the one that was up at the very top? Because I already went over there and didn't see much. Maybe there's something new there though. We'll take a quick quick peek. The overseer's place. This looks like the overseer. Oh, oh, the door opened. I am the overseer now. I'm much less schizophrenic and crazy than the past overseer. The overseer was known to be a bit scatterbrained. You'd probably find the code and fragments spread about the rooms opened by the master unlock. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Um, um... Green? <laughs> well then... I guess this needs to be done. Parkour time, baby! Whee!